Sorry. Yes, please. Can we be can we be seated? We are all welcome to this uh, very special uh, event, and we are honored at the embassy to have our papa here. Uh, before we proceed, I would want to welcome the members of the sorry introduce the members of the of the embassy. His Excellency Ambassador Adebowale Adeshino is the head of mission. Beside him is Ambassador Stephen Obidon, who is the deputy head of mission. Myself and Emmanuel Isaac Onogo, a first secretary. Here is Madam Mustafa Mala, our head of chancellor. Then Madam Susan over there, a top secretary. You are all welcome. I will now yield the floor to Pastor the leader from the Togolese uh, Church of Living of uh, Different Life to introduce his own delegation. We thank the Lord for this great opportunity to be discussing for on behalf of our nation Nigeria in this very embassy. We thank the Lord. First of all, I want to start by introducing our leader, the general superintendent at the convener of GCP, Pastor Dr. W. L. It's just by your side. So. <laughs> by his side is our mother, the Wife of our general superintendent, our mother, Mommy Esther Kumi. Yeah. From my front here, first of all, we have here Pastor Ojibusu, who is the national overseer and the coordinator, the zona coordinator. For this zone, Pastor Shalau. Beside him is um, Pastor Edison Daminapo. He is the state overseer of uh, uh, Cross River State in Nigeria and the chairman of the planning committee of GCG. Next sorry, um, I needed something in their lives. Uh, I can you please stand up? Uh, that's Pastor Casey's wife. Okay, thank you. Uh, next is 
Pastor James Nakokore. He is the head of media DCK. <laughs> Next is Pastor Stariki. He is a national overseer in Belgium. <laughs> Next to him is Pastor Claudius, a national overseer of the Republic, and that beside him is wife. <laughs> Next to him is Pastor uh, National Overseer of Madonewa for then, uh, next to him is Pastor Ete Benisa, the National Overseer of Togo here in the last Well, myself, I am Pastor Anya Sodo Christopher, uh, the National Overseer of Public of Madagascar. <laughs> um, the, Okay, please. Uh, I will allow the National Overseer of Togo to introduce some other uh, pastors that are here in Togo. Thank you. Uh, yeah, Pastor Ushabian of the of the church uh, uh, église en mission pour le salut église en mission pour le salut we have pastor napoli napoli is uh, the, the second the chairman of the uh, Fédération des évangéliques du Togo. Uh, is part of that uh, Christian Association, Fédération des églises évangéliques du Togo. So he represents our chairman. Uh, we have Pastor Chabri, he is an apostle, apostle Chabri, from l'église Le Bon Pâturage. Le bon pâturage. Uh, nous avons le pasteur Agbeko, le pasteur Agbeko de l'église baptiste du plein évangile. Nous avons le pasteur Dagali, qui est aussi de l'église baptiste du plein évangile. Merci beaucoup. Thank you very much, uh, the National Pastor, for that introduction. And Pastor Annette uh, Sedo. Thank you. I remember the name before. So, I think at this moment, we we'll welcome His Excellency Ambassador Debole Adeshino to welcome his guest before hearing from his guest. Good. Good uh, afternoon, everyone. Good morning, everybody. Papa, Mama, welcome. I'm sure that doesn't need a translation. I said, Father, Mom, Dad, Mom, you're welcome to Togo. Uh, let me start by confessing my personal joy and my personal delight at receiving Papa and Mama here this morning. I was supposed to go back home to Nigeria for some official thing yesterday. And uh, when my brothers and our fathers came around to say Papa was coming, I then remembered. Uh, the prayers I used to receive from my grandfather and my two friends back home uh, in our village. 
Et donc, quand euh, les pasteurs sont venus me dire que le pasteur Kouni devrait arriver, et donc je m'étais rappelé des prières que je recevais au village où j'étais enfant. I'm sure there's a variant of that prayer in all of our languages. Et je suis sûr que de cette prière-là, cela existe dans la plupart de nos langues traditionnelles. After telling me or praying to God to bless me, give me some tea, get a good wife, get good children, get everything as parents normally would do for children. After all of that, my parents would say, Ori and Kuni for a grand. Et après, mes parents ils terminent en disant ce qui vient de dire. Tu comprends ça? May your life, may your destiny, or literally speaking, may your faith not antagonize prayer, not reject prayer. Et donc, cela veut dire ce qui vient de dire, de façon littérale, c'est que ta pensée ne rejette pas nos prières. So, when I was told that Papa was coming, I made a promise to my uh, uncles and fathers who came around to say, on this particular trip, Only you need to go. My best friend will not get there. Et donc, quand j'ai appris que le pasteur, notre papa, est en train d'arriver, je me suis dit que cette fois-ci, ma pensée, mon esprit, ma destinée ne va pas rejeter les prières. So whatever it will take, I will wait and receive papa. Et donc, je pense que que cela me coûte, je vais attendre, je ne vais pas voyager et je vais recevoir le mon père. And as long as someone is here today, my prayer for all of us here. And for the people of Togo, for the people of Nigeria, and for the people of, Afri of Africa, especially, may our destiny not antagonize me. His prayers. Il est là en ce moment. Ma prière pour tout le monde, spécialement pour les Togolais, c'est que notre destinée, notre pensée, ne rejette pas ces prières. On the few occasions I've been at the church in Uganda, I saw Papa from afar, from the gallery. On the few occasions I've been at the church. So now that Papa was coming to my own bedroom, why would I leave him? So I decided I must leave him. You're welcome, sir. You are very happy to see me. You are tonight. Since I got here as ambassador of the Indian Africa, a lot of new things and first have occurred under our tenure here. So, depuis que je suis ici en tant que ambassadeur du Nigeria au Togo, de nouvelles choses et des choses uniques sont en train de se passer. And I believe Togo will be the first African country that GCK is coming to. Et donc je crois que le Togo fait partie des premiers francophones africains où Djisiki est en train d'arriver. I believe, I sincerely believe, Et je crois and pray que ma prière, that this visit, on this visit, on this visit, Togo will never remain the same. Amen. Je crois que ma partie de cette visite que le Togo ne reste plus comme il était. The people of Africa will not remain the same. Et Amen. les Africains ne vont plus demeurer comme ils étaient. Because the future belongs to the young ones. Parce que l'avenir appartient à la jeunesse. I took my time to go through the brochure that was presented to me the last time you guys talked, last time you said, and I saw a lot of appeal to the youth, especially the future of Africa. Et donc la dernière fois que j'étais là, tu m'avais présenté des brochures quand les personnes étaient là. Et donc j'ai pris du temps pour parcourir ces brochures. Et dans ces brochures, j'ai vu l'appel qui a été lancé à la jeunesse de l'Afrique. May the Almighty God continue to strengthen you as you do those, as you do the future generation, and of course, as you continue to celebrate the Lord Jesus Christ. I welcome you once again to Togo. Uh, the intro, the pastor who was introducing, I was almost going to say, Papa does not need any introduction to me. Maybe it is me who you should introduce to him, because he is our general in the service of the Lord, and we are following him as soldiers, and as the Lord live it. His life shall continue to be a blessing to all of us and humanity. Once again, I have very little to say for now, except to express my delight. You are welcome, you are welcome, and blessed by your presence. Amen. <laughs>
pas besoin de le présenter de façon plus facile de connaître. Ce qui devrait être fait, c'est de présenter le présenter en tant qu'ambassadeur pour façon pour lui. Parce que le façon pour lui est un général de la croix, c'est un général de tout le monde. Et il prie que sa présence ici soit une bénédiction pour tout le monde. Amen. Je vous remercie beaucoup, Votre Excellency, pour cette très édifiant et encourageant bienvenue. We appreciate that. At this moment, we yield the mic to uh, our Papa in the Lord to say a word or two. Your Excellency, the Ambassador, Son Excellence, Monsieur Ambassador, the and all the members of staff. I'm so delighted that we're here for this occasion at this time. My coming to Togo is not the first time. I've been coming for a number of years. I attended the university to learn some French. And since that time, I've been in touch with Togo. We have different kinds of meetings in Togo. Uh, when I think uh, President Sodom, you are here at some of the time I was there. And our national pastor here has not been interacting today. We reach the young people in Togo. There yeah, were uh, general meetings that have done wonderful things in our land in Togo. Okay. This time is special. We're here for a global crusade. And from Togo here, we'll be transmitting to many countries of the world. We'll be linking up with more than 150 countries of the world from Togo here at the Alpha location. This time the theme of our crusade is abundant life through Christ. And our understanding of abundant life will be very, very limited. But what Christ meant and what Christ is going to do is what we call now abundant life through Christ. This crusade will touch the life of everyone within, without, around, external. It will do great and mighty things for every participant. Every kind of problem will be addressed. There will be healing, there will be deliverance, there will be many, many miracles. Lives that are shattered and scattered will be put together. We are pleading to everyone to come. Government officials and our many Nigerians in the millions here in Togo and personally what the ambassador invited you. We are going to have a breakthrough process. And so tell everyone around. We are starting tomorrow. That is the 16th of February 2023. Until the 21st of February, which is Tuesday. Jusqu'à au 21, nous allons continuer jusqu'au 21 février. Et nous aurons également la conférence de ministres. Et cela va toucher les gens et va apporter un réveil sans précédent dans leur ministère. Ça, aujourd'hui, est spécialement dédié aux jeunes jeunes et aux jeunes jeunes. Le samedi sera dédié spécialement aux jeunes et aux jeunes professionnels. We are taking everyone to come up higher. Once again, Your Excellency, I'm 
grateful that you grant us this opportunity to have this God save the seat. God bless everyone. God bless everyone. Uh, thank you very much. I think at this moment uh, we are all or we have heard from our Papa, the special guest, he have said his purpose for being here. And it is believed that from here we all will communicate his message to Et others. So at this moment, our duty, our remaining duty, is to please take a little refreshment that the embassy can offer. Thank you. Yes, yes. Have you called the Thank <laughs> Uh, it doesn't uh, 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 u